Hey what's up you guys, today I'm going to be doing a quick unboxing video. I am super excited for this one. Um, I'm trying to be a little bit quiet when recording this video. One, my little brother has FSAs tomorrow, which is uh, standardized testing in our state. Um, and two, it's like 9 o'clock at night. I just got back from the Sprint store and I'm so excited. Oh, I just smacked my chair. Um, because I got a brand new phone for my birthday because tomorrow is May 1st, my 21st birthday. I have here iPhone XS. So the people have not set it up. It is synced to our account and everything. Um, I had them put on a screen protector. Um, I ordered online um, a case for it. So I'm going to be extra careful for the two days while Amazon ships me my case. But I have not seen it really at all. It's all exactly how it comes in the box. Only thing is, is that the people did open it to put a screen protector on it for me so that I do not have to, which will be a much better unboxing video than my iPhone SE unboxing, which I had in a case and everything right out of the box. Couldn't even like do it. I saw it, messed with it. I have not set this one up completely, 100% brand new. Let's get into it. I got this in space gray, 64 gigabytes. It's trying to say hello, um, messing with my lighting and everything, but brightness all the way up. We'll do the setup in just a moment. Um, I'm gonna set this down, even though it's the bright of the show. Look at that camera lens. Look at the double lens. You can see I do have the tempered glass screen protector on it. I had them put it on so that it would not void the warranty. This tempered glass was $50, I think, after taxes and everything. But if it breaks, they'll replace it lifetime warranty if my phone breaks underneath it they will cover it so i'm very happy for that the rest of the things in the box are pretty standard we've got a normal apple charging brick we've got brand new headphones which i'm assuming they're gonna yep be lightning cable because this one doesn't have a headphone jack so super glad about this doesn't come with a dongle just comes with straight headphones with the uh, lightning cable to headphones which is great because I'm still gonna want to use my headphones and I love the Apple shape of the headphones which is 50 50 for some people but this is the only headphone shape that fits in my ear I don't know why but it's just how it is um, these are the only ones that fit in my ear any other shapes with like with the little um, cup over them they just don't fit in my ear shape I have those very small ears and these fit perfectly in them so super excited for that and then we just have um, a small lightning cable which I of course have lots of lightning cables I already had an iPhone so that's good okay so I just took my iPhone SE out of the case which yes it's a little dirty um, it has really never come out of its case so there's that but we're gonna do um, a side-by-side -side comparison of thickness of course my SE is a little thicker because it's more of a brick but really they do compare in thicknesses which is kind of crazy um, obviously this one is a lot bigger um, I do, I'm actually surprised, I do think I can get used to this. If I had gotten the XS Max, I don't think I would have been able to hold it comfortably, but I know that the SE is very small when it comes to phones nowadays. This one was a good phone to me, lasted me a long time, and I'll probably still use it. Um, if I'm doing things with my camera, I could use this as an angle, this as an angle, and then I always still have my iPod Touch. Though I'm not sure how much it's holding a charge because I haven't used it in quite some time. So those are the comparisons of my previous and current phones. So that is what we got going on. That's crazy looking. <laughs> it's just going through all of the wonderful hellos. So what we're going to do is select English, United States. Um, 
let's see it says I can do quick start but I always start up manually um, it's asking me for my Wi-Fi um, I'm gonna need that password actually just gonna say whoa there's a whole space down here underneath the keyboard I don't know if you guys can see I don't know now it won't stop focusing on my face so let's put in the Wi-Fi password face ID Oof. okay iPhone can recognize the unique three-dimensional features of your face to unlock automatically, use Apple Pay, make purchases from iTunes and Apple stores. I do wonder, I have glasses, what about when I don't wear glasses? Or what if I change my hair suddenly? I want it as a new iPhone, but I still want to access my old stuff, so I'm not sure what that would do, but let's set it up as a new iPhone and log into my iCloud and see what happens. It is setting up my Apple ID. Fall, 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 focus on me. Focus on me. Focus on me. What if I wear makeup and it looks like a totally new face? <laughs> Express settings, you can use the settings below or customize them individually. Next, it wants me to set up Apple Pay. I will do that later in Wallet. Let's set up Siri. Oh, wow. Okay, so here's my brand new iPhone. Um, let's go into settings and try to set up Siri. I don't know if I have to... Hey, Siri! That's an issue. Hey Siri. How are you today? I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Okay, so it kept my settings from before. That's cool. Alright. Yeah, it has all of my settings from before. So Okay, so that's really weird. I'm gonna have to get used to not having a button down here. So that's really big change for me. I guess I'm just gonna play with my new phone and do all my basic settings, but all of the setup and stuff has been done. I have properly unboxed it. Um, the home button's on the side instead of on the top. That's weird. Probably because it's a bigger phone. Oh! <laughs> it's unlocked for my face. It's so weird. I thought Touch ID was like the coolest thing ever when it came out, but now that Face ID is a thing, ooh, that's crazy. I wonder if I can put different faces in. Well, I'm gonna go play with my new phone now. Um, happy birthday to me. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment below your thoughts and ideas and whatever you wanna say. Um, please hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. Um, I post new videos every Saturday. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!